Hello, friends. We are coming to you at what? Is, you think I'm weird? No, these settings are so weird. She has them. Oh, Abby? Yeah. Well, Cause she's a different body type than you, my friend. She's like. We just dropped Abby off. In fact, she's probably, yep, she's right behind me. Oh, she's going that way. She's not in her car. I mean, our car, but she's driving Kaylee's car home. Oh, she went to the light. That would be a better option. She's smart. Um, we got Abby, or Kaylee's windshield fixed in her car and Jason agreed See? to pay for it. <laughs> it's his car technically, so. He would rather. But we dropped, him. yeah. We, he still thinks it's, that's like his. Well, thing. yeah, he's like, I gotta maintain that car, and, and if I keep paying for things like this, it's, um, it's my car. So, anyway, we got it fixed, and Kaylee is at the lake today, so Abby agreed to meet me, or come with me, and take it home. But we are gonna go to, I think we should go to Michael's, just to change it up a bit. Um, we've got we go to Hobby Lobby often enough. Just I want to see something different, and then we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. I want to try that um, Bum Bum lotion. The dupe. I want their mist. Well, we're gonna go look for those kinds of things at Trader Joe's, and I'm gonna get a little snack for a friend of mine. She's having a I beat cancer party today at the park. She's having one of her favorite Alabama little bands come and play. Um, she's from Alabama. She loves like bluegrass, kind of good stuff like that. So we're just gonna go and celebrate her with her, but I wanted to take a little little something with me. I'm, she's not gonna go. I'm gonna go by myself. Um, us girls and other people are coming to celebrate with her. It's also her birthday, so good. Uh, diagnosis with her cancer that she has beat it so far and she's done with chemo and um, anyway she's super cute because she has a bald head and it's fuzzy and it's growing back and it reminds me of all you girls when you were little and your little that hair's your mess. little I know it is now but all your little blonde hair I need to when you were little hair. so let's go to Michael's first just because I want to fight that traffic first and then we'll meander back over here Okay, Ash, did you find what you wanted? Mm -hmm. Magnet tape, where we can just cut what we want, and glue sticks, because we're out. Okay, this is for the Sol de Janeiro, what is it, what number? Um, 39. 39, we're at Trader Joe's. This is for the Sun Bum? 62. 62, is that's that the one I get? That, yeah, that's for 71. 71, how do you, like, the fact that you know this stuff. And that's also, this is for, that's Yeah, the same, same one right here. All right, Trader Joe's was really busy, so I didn't really pull the camera out very much. Ashley got some of these. Oh my gosh, these are so good. It goes the other way. Okay, so let's show what else we've got. We need to keep those up here. No, 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 don't put them in the sun. <laughs> you literally put it on the dash. We got Dad some of his favorite gummies. I got myself a little snack for I don't think I can take that to the beach tomorrow. It will melt. Uh, hand me the two things that are for her, and I will show those last. Well, no, I can show those now. I got her, my friend, it's her birthday, and she's celebrating cancer-free. Peony Blossom scented candle. I thought that was kind of cute. I was gonna get food, candy, something, but it's gonna melt. It is 92, see, I knew it was hot. It's 92 degrees outside, and whatever I take, it's gonna be, it's gonna melt at the park where we're going. That's a scam, but they literally like. Why? It just doesn't, I thought it was like, oh, oh okay, she's opening my, okay, hang on. So then the other thing I got her was this lip mask, vanilla lip mask. I saw a video the other day and um, it was a whole video on all the dupes. So I can't remember, what is this? Lynette. Said my 11 year old. Lynette. <laughs> <laughs> and the fact that she says it correctly blows my mind. Okay, now. My friends were obsessed with Okay, now we're gonna. She's open I've this already body the body butter. Packaging. I do like that packaging where it's easy to open. It, it smells exact. Oh, that smells really good. <laughs> I, even if it's not an exact. You already have that body butter from the actual Solution Arrow brand. Yeah, but there's not much left in it because it was yeah, the travel one. size. So I, I use it sparingly. I don't use it. Yeah. Very, yeah. 
It's thick. I know. It's body like, butter. It's, it's body like, butter is different. This might be my cheaper way of having this. Like, that smell. I want to smell the coconut now. I know. But she doesn't have any money. You can borrow this one. My not, henna not very I uh, Oh, yeah. I Here, should we show your henna? So, Kaylee, Chelsea, That's and funny. Ashley have been doing henna. Don't mind that one. On their hands. But you have one on your back, too. Um, oh, yeah. It's kind of... It's fading. Yeah, it's fading. I will get but, it. It's kind of cool. All right, came back home. Ashley's inside. I got this cute little bag. Uh, who's calling me? Oh. Hey, how you doing? Good. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm just trying to put a little gift together for Kitty. Okay. Are you headed home soon? Uh, no, I just finished my last customer, and I'm already here, and I still have not done quarterly taxes, so I'm just going to stick around and do them. All right. Are you going to go for... Is that cool? Is that yeah. cool? Well, yeah, because I'm just going to go to her thing, and you're not going to have fun doing that. What, the, who, what thing is it? Kitty celebrating cancer and her birthday. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I mean... I guess I'd like to talk to the guys and all, but... I don't think guys are going to be there. Okay. Then, yeah. I'll just... Just hang out. So... Okay. Um, well, I'll uh, just... Um, I'll text you when I'm headed home. You just get the work done. Are you going to go for a run tonight? No. I'm going to rest this week. So oh, to get ready to go? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's my strategy. Okay. Um... Yep. Okay. Well, I'm gonna head out then. Okay. Okay. Love you. I got you some uh your little favorite gummies at Trader Joe's. Oh, you're so kind. So they'll be on the counter for you. Okay. All right. Thank you. I love you. Have fun. Love you too. Bye. Everybody, hi. Okay. I'm gonna take these guys all inside, and then I've got the little gift in this cute little bag. I always like to save bags we get from people. So I've got the candle in there with some of that cute little fluffy tissue stuff. Figured that was kind of cute. We'll just set those both on top and then I'll take that to her. I have an old cup. I'm gonna put some, probably a poppy. We're gonna put some, I've got some ice in here that I just, sorry, I've been in and out of the car. I've got some ice in here, but Jason calling kind of stop me. I'm going to grab a poppy from, not those ones. Those ones aren't cold. I'm going to get a, do I want a poppy? I probably should not do an Alani this late in the evening. So we'll do maybe a raspberry rose. The watermelon ones are the best though. Where's all the watermelon ones? We're going to do a water or a raspberry rose poppy in with my um, ice. It's going to be hot. So I'm going to stick this inside the door here. And you've been trying to like, of course they left that door open. Hang on. Sorry. Where did I put my phone? It's probably not smart to leave my phone in my, oh, I don't have my drink. Okay. I'm going to get ready to go. Yeah. I got to go. I'm actually going to wait before putting my um, drink on the ice. I'm going to eat some of it. Just so I can have it more fresh when I get there. Then I don't have to walk around with my heavy Stanley cup, but I have a good drink and then I can throw my cup away when I'm done <laughs> drinking my drink. The lid is not worth lidding. All right, I'm gonna go. As you heard, Jason's gonna stay, get some office work done. He does have to take some time off work to do the climb with the boys soon. So he's gotta get caught up in order to take the time off. It's nice because he can take time off kind of whenever he wants to, whenever it works, schedule-wise, but he doesn't have like, he only gets two weeks of vacation a year or anything like that. You also have to like, take care of business. <laughs> you have to make sure everything gets done as well. There's pros and cons to owning your own business. And tonight it's at work late, so.
All right, so we're having so much fun. This is the little train station where we get the train park, as we call it, where we get the girls back to school photos. And I just realized we're not gonna have Kaylee in our school photos unless I get my button gear before she, it's not possible to get our photos taken. Anyway, we're having a great time, but it's super hot. It's like, it was 90 degrees today. And uh, trying to, anyway, we're inside the little train station there. Listening to this little Alabama band, super fun. Um, but a friend of mine, two friends of mine just texted me and she's like, hang on, I gotta go find in the crosswalk. And she texted me, she's, she lives way far south, but her and her friend that moved to Texas that used to live here, they just texted me and they said, hey, are you gonna be at the concert on the green, which is right across the street from where we're at. And I was like, what do you mean? You don't live here and, and Dallas doesn't live here in the state. But anyway, they're here visiting and they're coming over to this concert on the green. And uh, I told them, come over to the train station. All of our friends are literally at the train station. And, uh, and then anyway, so I'm walking over to see if I can find them. They said that we would walk over here and see everyone before they did the concert on the green. All right, if you notice, it is pitch black outside. It is midnight. <laughs> I just had the best time ever, and we're gonna spend the day tomorrow, to spend the day to together tomorrow too. Um, they're gonna come to the beach with us. Well, they're gonna, just gonna come and join us. Um, but we did the concerts at the green for the last half hour, um, so I don't have much footage. I'm not going the right way because I'm not paying attention. Um, but I literally haven't seen one, both of these friends for like a year. One of them, probably even longer than that. I can't remember when I saw her last. But we just have so much to talk about and anyway, both of them are going through so much and we went back to, so we said, we all just said, we're not done talking, we're not done hanging out. And they all have like tons of kids between them. <laughs> so, and the kids weren't done hanging out and playing. And so we went back to our other friend's house that they were with and um, we just walked back to her house and she has a cute little backyard and her husband ordered us pizza and cut up watermelon for us. And the kids played and we just talked as girls and just had a fantastic time. And I'm just super grateful that they texted me and said, hey, we're here. Um, I totally unexpected night. I literally was gonna be going home by 7 p.m. and no plans to do anything else and <laughs> get everything ready for the beach tomorrow and be a little ahead of the game, but I wouldn't take back this night at all. I had so much fun talking to my friends and I feel like tomorrow at the beach we might have some more like easier time talking when the kids are off playing in the lake and stuff, um, which will be nice. Um, but I'm actually hoping um, while the one is here from Texas that I can actually like get together with her just like even individually just because it would be it's hard to have conversations when it's interrupted with kids and I just can feel like I we're both in different places than the last time we were together and when she moved when she lived here and it would just be really nice to fully catch up and talk and like all that kind of stuff so I will take what I can get for tonight and then hopefully we can hang out tomorrow but um crazy night crazy crazy fun night Jason's already going to bed uh I likely will have to get up with him tomorrow morning and move the cars but um I don't know what day is it Tuesday it's only Tuesday <sighs> yeah because Wednesday is beach day so I'm gonna sign off with you guys because I do need to get up early in the morning to get everything ready for the beach in order to like be able to be ready to go when I get home from walking because I still I'm still doing it I am day 11 or 12 at, on my walking streak I haven't missed a day so I'm having a great time with that I'm gonna keep going I'm going to sign off with you guys and go tuck myself into bed so take care thanks for joining me um, find your people like I, I love that I, I need to stay in touch with these guys more 
often. The one, especially the one that lives here in the state. I need to actually like take time to go down and see her because it's hard for her to come up here because she has some kids and it's enough of a trek. I need to make that effort um, and do better. So anyway, take care you guys. I had a great night and I appreciate you guys joining in with me and sharing in my adventures. And um, so anyway, take care. We'll see you later. That's not police pulling me over. They have a motorcyclist pulled over. But somehow I haven't triggered. Oh, I tri it triggered. My light is a red light. And it has not triggered. And Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was like, how long am I going to sit at this light? And I can't make any, like, strange maneuver to get through the light a different way. Because the cops are sitting right next to my car. <laughs> it's like, I can't do a U-turn. I can't run a red light. Couldn't do anything because they're literally next to my car. Like, I could have reached out and said hi. So, anyway, I really am going to bed. <laughs> going home. Take care.